Hey collectors, Anthony from Hashersnet here, and we're taking a look at uh, some Dragon Ball Z Otherworld characters from the Bandai toy line. Wow, this is a diverse range of gods and otherworld beings that um, make sense in this context. Mainly because I didn't have another place to really stick them. I also would like to point out that articulation varied depending on when these figures came out and if they were like uh, side characters for somebody. For example, uh, King Kai came with Bubbles, Dende came with uh, Corrin, or actually Yadrobi yeah, might have came with Corrin. But either way, one of them came with Corrin. And then of course we have uh, Kabito, and then we have the Supreme Kai Shen, and then over here we have PyCon. So let's start on the left here. Um, so. Shin cannot stand out on his own and barely can uh, Kibito, so I kind of used him to counterbalance. Uh, he's one of the earlier figures from like the Boo era. Um, articulation is very limited because of his uh, coat. Um, just uh, like he has some mid range arm movement, um, which is, I guess, fine. You can get him to do this. His head barely moves, his legs barely move. It's a very, very simple figure. But I mean, He's not like he's a fighter per se, so I mean that that's fine, I guess. Um, we get to Kabito here. Um, he has a lot more. He has he gets the bend here. He has a universal joint. If not for his jacket, uh, he'd be able to get all the way around here. Uh, he has very limited head because of his hair, and um, because of his jacket, he has no leg. And it's basically position his leg as best as you can and hope he stands up. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for him. It's it's not a lot, uh, but he's a big guy. And, again, he's also not a fighter. So I kind of get the logic. And if they're not fighters, we don't really need to give them a lot of articulation. So here is Dende. Uh, of course, this is the kid form Dende right after an Android Saga where he takes over as the Earth's Protector. And uh, is it, this is all soft goods, uh, by the way. I, except, except maybe this, the rest of it, like, this is soft, this is soft. Actually, these, these are hard, the shirt and the arms, obviously. Uh, he just has uh, up and down here. He has no head because of the thing. He barely any leg because of the, the skirt. Uh, but again, not a fighter. So not really expected here. Just uh, some pliable antennae. And that's it for uh, Dende there. Uh, so Bubbles came with, obviously, King Kai. Up and down arms, and that is it. He's just meant to sit in the background, you know, scratch his head. Uh, surrender. <laughs> That's it for him. Uh, Corrin, I think, came with Yajirobe. Um, he doesn't even do anything. He's just a piece that you stick there. Hey, Yajirobe's, ta Yajirobe's talking. Here's Corrin, you know. Because you have to have a Corrin. And, uh, here's King Kai. Uh, I'm surprised these haven't come off yet. I mean, these figures are so old. But, yeah, it's still good. His head spins. Universal joint on the arms. Goes all the way around. Uh, legs. Uh, very familiar. Uh, this is the type of thing. He, the boob also has experiences where his legs are very limited because of the, the gown he wears or whatever. This is a very simple King Kai with his symbol on front. Not too much going on over there. And then finally, PyCon, which I thought was the coolest thing when I bought him for my little brother. Hat comes off. You can see his head. He is one of the later series in the line figures uh, because he has the head articulation that is up and down, left and right. He has a universal joint. He has the mid arm or elbow bend. He has uh, the actual legs that bend out. He has a soft good here. He has the, the full articulation um, uh, ankles. He has everything. This is this is near the peak of the finale of that line, and they did a really good job with PyCon with it. So it was really nice to see him. But then he also, if they produce a PyCon, yeah, no, they were kind of running low on the uh, figures. With that said, tell me in the comments your thoughts on these items. Did you get them? And how was your experience with them? Thanks for watching, and please remember to like and subscribe.